final main stage production of Classical Theatre Company's fifth anniversary season. Uh, we are producing uh, The Merchant of Venice by William Shakespeare, uh, as adapted by uh, our dramaturg Shay Cooper. My name is Philip Lale, and I'm playing one of two unnamed guys in this production of Merchant of Venice. Um, both guys in this play are prisoners at a concentration camp during World War II. My name is Tom Pryor, and I'm playing uh, Shylock, Lorenzo, and Gabo. My name is Matthew Keenan, and I will be playing the role of the Nazi soldier. The simplest way that I've heard this play explained is it answers the question, what would happen um, if the Nazis in a concentration camp made two guys who were probably actors in their life before they made it to the concentration camp. What would happen if they made them perform uh, some form of Shakespeare's play, The Merchant of Venice? Basic, basically, the concept of this play is, is really fascinating. It's um, The Merchant of Venice uh, set in Auschwitz. Uh, so you have two prisoners, essentially, who are uh, forced, two Jewish prisoners who are working in a sorting room, uh, forced to do this play by the Nazi guards. And of course, all of the references to uh, anti-Semites, anti um, anti-Semitic behavior, can now be tossed back at the Nazis. Yeah, well, I, I play the, the Nazi soldier, and uh, I think one of the, one of the great things about, about playing that role is that, that the other two actors can feed off my presence and, and the Nazi presence in the room rather than the idea of the Nazis being there, but that I'm actually in the room with them the whole time. This production achieves what the classical theatre company always strives for, which is to provide a, a never-before-seen quality to the classics. And it's something that we're really excited to bring to our audiences, uh, as although The Merchant of is obviously a very popular piece, this is a very different take on this play. Why would you tell people that they should experience this play, this production? That's a good question. I, I think because when they come here, they'll be changed. And I think that's what theater needs to do. Um, they'll be perhaps changed in such a way and, and look at this piece of history with the Holocaust and, and look around them and see human beings for what they are. Uh, we're a diverse society here in Houston, here in, in, in America. and there really is no place for what happened in World War II with Nazi Germany and the Holocaust. And, you know, I think it has far-reaching implications. And if they just come here and say, wow, that was moving, that was effective, and uh, I am going to look to the person to my left and right in a, in a whole different way.